In our next Automate training video, we'll be exploring dual clutch transmissions. Producing lightning fast shifts and substantial efficiency gains, these complex gearboxes are considered by many to be the transmission of the future. In the meantime, here's a preview of what you can expect to see in this module. The design of the DCT and concentric clutch assembly requires the use of a dual input shaft layout. The front clutch friction plate is splined to the inner solid shaft, while the rear friction plate is splined to a hollow outer shaft. A shared fourth and sixth gear is formed at the rear of the shaft, while second and reverse also shared at the front. The inner shaft is designed using separate drive gears for first, third and fifth. This DCT uses two output shafts mounted in parallel to transfer torque from the six forward gears to the final drive assembly. Output shaft A houses third, fourth and reverse speed gears, while output shaft B holds first, fifth, sixth and second speed gears. Just like a conventional manual transmission, speed gears are free to rotate on the shaft until they are locked to that shaft using a synchroniser hub and sleeve assembly. At the very front and affixed to each output shaft is a pinion gear. The pinion is used in the same manner as a conventional final drive pinion gear. So if you're ready to take your knowledge and training to the next level, why not subscribe to Automate Training today? Visit automatetraining.com to change the way you think about training.